So the prologue is the prologue, who cares? It's the tutorial map, there's like 8 enemies, just listen to dad or whatever. But it does have these dense forests with this big dumb watchtower that naturally guides you to fight in this tight area. The initial limited movement with the base classes mixed with the positioning that followed the previous engagement makes it a little tricky to position yourself without giving the enemy at least some of the forest tiles. You could go around to the left or wait for them to come past the forest, but then green unit daddy will kill every last one of- I like this design. If this were an actual map, it would probably rank well. This gets a P out of 10. Chapter 1 follows up as another tutorial map. Fallen units come back at the end of the chapter. This lets people get a feel for the game without having to worry too much about the consequences. The amount of characters you can bring to this map is limited to 5. This is their way of easing you into controlling your entire class going forward. The map has 10 enemy units. You end up facing them in groups of 3 to 4 units. And since they are the other students of comparable stats to your own, it's much rarer to one round each group, and you'll take a decent amount of retaliation damage if your strategy isn't on point. I like this. The biggest downside for this chapter is there isn't much use of the terrain. This is a large map, and a lot of it doesn't even get used. I know it's probably to be recycled in auxiliary battles, but even then you're fighting in the same general areas. The forests are spread out, and the low movement of the base classes limits each side from getting terrain advantage. Which is okay. It's a simple map where you're supposed to be learning about enemy movement patterns. Plus they have this little formation on the left that forces you to fight the enemy at range while trying to take down the structure and only they get terrain advantage. It's a nice little challenge. Except for the fact that they just leave the structure, what the fuck? This feels like dumb AI at its finest or a beginner trap for anyone dumb enough to try it. Either way, it feels like a massively wasted opportunity. If they rearrange this structure to make you have to address it, and they added a few more forest tiles, this map would have been pretty highly rated. But right now it's a 5 out of 10. It teaches some things well, and it misses out on other important lessons.